The Psycho P Show, a.k.a. The World's Worst Name Podcast. Um, yeah, I'm down. Okay. I sure do. Dude, what the fuck? This fucking why are iPhones so weird? They're like sensitive and then not sensitive. Like what the fuck? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So weird. No, I'm not I mean, really sure, but yo, there was a lot of traffic on the way back. Yeah. Is there any way to go around that, or is that impossible? We're gonna try the 101 and hit it, and then if it's bad, we'll hop off. And then there's another way to sort of go about it. But to be honest. That's the only way? Um, it's the best way to check. This is sort of early in the traffic zones, and we're two people on mm-hmm. an HOV, so... The last time that we um, left here, it was, like, um, a little bit later. But today is Friday. So... Mm-hmm. You know, it is what it is. It is what it is, my friend. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm done to get some Mexican. Yo! Yo! What's up? Okay. What decided? Mm. Um. What me? Okay, yo, VJ. So the company that Emily uh, emailed about. Should I pause? Yeah. yeah. Bro, you picked up the fucking phone again. Was that your mother? Oh, my God. You're a sick oh fuck, dude. God. You're a sick fuck. What the fuck, man? You really? That's You were waiting that whole time for that? Why not? Why not? Were you just building it up? Were you just like... No, no, no. I realized it midway. I was like, wait, what the fuck? I was like, once again, totally with his compulsion. Oh, God. You do understand in the other shows, your fucking phone has got to go somewhere else. I have to take it from you. Yeah, dude, the only reason I picked up this one is because we were just at, I don't know, maybe no, no, you, I, maybe I, you I, love. No, I, I understand. Trust me. Yeah. I was just fucking with you. No. <laughs> do you like that car right there? That Volt? It looks better than the old version, dude. Bro, the, is that the all electric car? Do you know how much that car is? It's like 60 grand. Is it? You so think it's worth it? No. You love Chevys? Some Chevys. Not really the new Chevy. Yo, um, so you wouldn't fuck with any all electric cars? Oh, with a Tesla for sure. The Tesla. I, fu- I fuck with a Tesla and maybe the new Ford electric cars. Because you know, they're going to be partnered with Google and Uber. Yeah, I heard about that. You know how they're just trying to come out with a really cheap one? Yeah. I think that that partnership, a self driving cheap one mm. for like $15,000. Yeah, like a small one. Bro. Small, small car that drives I can't wait. It's nice. Bro, I can't wait till all cars are self driving because then I want to even fucking. Then I'll be back in the driving game. But I'm fucking done with that shit. I don't want to talk <laughs> You're about You're back it. in the driving game. But fuck being fucking... Like, what What would cops patrol for at that point? I wonder what the insurance is going to cost for it. What's up? I wonder what the insurance is going to be for that car. Uh, insurance, car insurance might become negligible if the, if the, um, if the accidents has really become like zero. Or close to zero. Do you know what I'm saying? If yeah. accidents become less than 1%, car insurance will become a fucking bullshit scheme that eventually people will oh my rise God, up dude, against. Dude. Because they're like, why am I paying insurance when no one can get in accidents because all the cars are being driven by whatever? And they're like, what about earthquakes? Like, okay, then give me fucking, fucking, you know, like natural disaster damage is not the same thing as car. Wait, what if you hit an elk? Destroy your car, bro. The, the, the self-driving cars should be able to see that. Otherwise, they're not really self-driving. Mm, I don't know. Yeah. Like, what if it just runs out? <laughs> right I mean, you do understand that it's like, dude. I saw an elk one time, bro. It was like the size of a. It's like two times the size of a Mini Cooper, probably. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna say that that type of shit happened. But I'm saying it's going to be so small of a chance that paying insurance would be, like, so small. Like, maybe it would be, like, a tax. Dude, it's crazy how insurance is, like, how everyone has to pay insurance. It's, like... That's a bullshit. Yo, it's It's unbelievable. Imagine every car on the road right now is paying at the very least $150 a month. 
Yeah, the ones you get pulled over. Where does all that money go to? Like, it goes to these companies who jack up your rates once you get in an accident. Because an accident. It's a no is fault. Wait, is this go. a no fault state as well? I, I'm not. I'm not too sure. In New Jersey, yeah. If you get into an accident, and even though it's not your fault, your insurance still goes up. Oh yeah, over here it definitely can happen. That's it such is. fucking. My car, my car got hit when I was parked. My car got hit when I was parked. went up. If you tell my me your insurance, insurance went up, oh my god. Okay, I'm about to self-emulate right now. Go ahead. I'm, I'm tired of this shit. Go ahead. Take off my fingers. I swear to God. <laughs> Yo, uh... I'm done. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. I'm, I'm out of here. Set You're jumping out. on fire. And I mean, maybe this is the time you should jump out quarters. the 70 mile an hour. Fucking Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> maybe this should be the time you jump out of a 70 mile an hour vehicle. You're going 60. Go 70. All right, and go and, and I'll think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Bro, I can't wait till that... I. There's so many things in the future I, I really hope happen, but bro, it's about to be uh yeah get that get that lead dog get that lead dog you want me to chase it down man? I can't really it's all right I got it yeah look at all the shitty traffic on the way back you should fucking totally the worst the, the worst Siri of all time the worst I'm just fucking with you bro. Okay, the worst. Yo, what is... Look at that arena they're building over there. What the fuck is that? Wait, this one? Yeah. Oh! Is this that is a arena? baseball arena. Yeah, I'm just like... They're stadium. Another one? Baseball stadium. What's up, Via Yeah, it looks new. I heard that when a uh, new uh, freeway they're building, the 303, they're, they're shooting Transformers over there. No way. Yeah. Wait, where's the 303? It's not... It's not completely made. The 303 is a, a freeway that's going to link that other side, the 202, all the way. It's going to, like, make it quicker to get to Vegas and no way. parts in Cali. Really? Yeah. Very nice. That's why I love yeah, yeah, yeah. I love AZ for that. Dude, man, if it wasn't for the fucking, like, crazy cops and court system, this place would be, like, really ideal. But when you think about it, that's... It's sort of the price you pay. It's the price you pay. Yeah. <laughs> but and and hopefully it'll change soon because it's looking like a lot of stuff will change here soon. But right now, or in like the past, like fucking like probably thirty years, it's been rough out here, bro. Uh-huh. But now the city, now that it's sort of popping and it's growing, it's better. But you remember when there's, you probably you don't remember, but because you weren't here. But there was a point when there's no downtown. There wasn't really anything popping. The food was good, but it wasn't. Like I actually I visited everywhere. Arizona State when I was coming out of high school. Yeah, this is one of the schools that, that I applied to, and I visited here. And I do remember that downtown Phoenix was like nothing there. There's nothing like. It's only the stadium, and that's this, it. The city's growing a lot, and your dollar here goes far. That's why, like, when you say like, "Yo, you should go to New York or some shit," I'm like, "Bro, like, I'm not used to paying that much yeah. fucking money to just live." Yeah, it's and nice. I'm I'm willing to do it, but I don't have any. Context yet, there, man. That that if I go with no context and nothing set, I'll I'll spend a shit ton of money. Mm-hmm. Well, right here, I mean, see the thing is like, I'm not stuck to right here. I just need the opportunity, and the opportunities we're building here can take us anywhere, bro. Yeah, like I agree. like if a New York fucking or a New Jersey radio station says like, yo, we'll pay you fucking twenty G's a month to come out here and fucking host our radio station or some shit. We're not quitting the podcast, Mm -hmm. but we're going to go out there. (laughs) You know what I'm saying? Like, why the fuck not? Mm -hmm. Take that money and and get more exposure, get in the fucking game. I don't know where the fuck this is going to take us. Mm -hmm. I just know that I'm going to go where I want to go in terms of, like, whatever skill. We're just going to keep pushing on here, man. Keep trucking, bro. Are we about to hit up that Mexican spot? Yeah. Oh, very nice. Very well, man. See, you know, no matter how, like... No matter how shitty I'm feeling, dude, if you tell me we're going to get some Mexican food, it just makes everything better. Is it bad that food makes me so happy? What's that? Is it, is it bad that food makes me so happy? Um, not really, not really. No. We, um, did you want to go to the Mexican spot by my house? Is that what you're saying? It doesn't thinking? even matter, bro. doesn't matter. My, uh, near my house or your house, it doesn't matter. I got to make a quick stop by my crib real okay. quick. And then we'll sort of decide from okay. there. Okay. Um, cause, uh, and, you know, I'm probably, I, I gotta, I gotta meet someone, but. Okay. And I don't know if we can like record. Yo, I just realized that today's the game. I'm gonna, uh, oh, oh, record video? Yeah. Oh yeah. Today's it's okay. Um. It's six. It starts. As long as we keep recording some shorts and shit, 
Um, and we'll just keep pushing. Yeah, I, I love recording the video, but as long as there's some content being recorded, we'll keep it pushing. Definitely, like, videos becoming key for, like, it's going to be key for Facebook and shit, so I want to keep keep recording video as aggressively as possible. Of course. So, whatever I'm saying now, it doesn't change anything. Of course. But, whatever. Oh. <laughs> like, what hearted <laughs> Yeah, but, whatever. I always have a good message, but a lot of times it ends in whatever. Dude, what do you think is going to be here? Look at all this flat fucking land. I think Bro. it's going to be like a big-ass mall. Probably, right? Maybe. There's one that was just sort of back there, so maybe something else. But it's gonna be something. There's no way they're gonna give up that. This is all native land, probably. Yeah. Uh, I think that. Yeah, I think the native land's on the left side, and this is all city land, and they just haven't built into it. Or I think it might be late. I don't know, dude. You might be right. It might still be native land because I know the gas stations that are within a mile away from the freeway Uh here of the one one here. They don't sell alcohol. Oh no way. Yeah, because it's native land. Oh, they don't sell alcohol on, on native land. Uh, no. Not it's weird stations. because I've been. I in, think uh, they might have liquor stores, but I've been on native land before and I've seen drunk like people. Oh like, yeah, I mean a lot of people around. get drunk as fuck. And and the thing is, and I and I sort of think it runs in Asians too. I was told, so it's probably like in my blood a little bit. But it's really bad with Native Americans. But they don't process alcohol the same way. Asians don't process alcohol normally. You know? Yeah, it's like a lot of them. They don't have this enzyme. I think it's super red. Yeah. See, I I think like. With me, like, I don't get drunk, and then all of a sudden I get drunk. So, uh-huh. I don't know. You know, we were drinking a little bit for the show and shit. I like that. But I think I'm just going to just drink for occasions a little bit and just nothing too special. Yeah, you know, just get, like, a nice bottle of whiskey. Just have it always chilling. Just pour yeah. yourself yeah, a little like, whiskey, a couple ice cubes. Just yeah, chilling. I like the show, you know what I'm saying? But I, I just don't like drinking that much, man. And, like, the thing is, like, either, I go to, I, like, it's the only thing, like, I can, like, fight off fatigue from weed and shit. It's no problem. But alcohol, man, you've seen it. Like, at some point, like, I'm just like, dude, I got to pass out. Mm. I can't help it. This just, like, fucks me up. Mm-hmm. And, like, it's weird, too, because, like, it depends how tired I am. It's just, like, all fucked up. So I just, I'm, I'm just... You know, I'm just gonna continue to be off it, but probably even be more diligent. If we go out, if I go out of town for a little bit, I'll have a little bit, but I don't think I can even drink more than like five drinks in a day ever. I'm on that. Well, five drinks a day is a lot. No, but I'm saying like five drinks like for a wedding. My like roommate probably drinks five drinks a day. Drink some brews after work. Oh, hundred percent. But I'm saying, like, if I go to, like, when I go to my wedding, my Yo, homie's wedding Can in I tell New you York, something, bro? You I'm might have, you, like, three you, drinks. You might have to pause this. Fuck. It's not something crazy. Yeah, there's no way I can tell this over here. Is it, is it just that it's embarrassing kind of or legal? No, no, no. Yo, just trust me. Go ahead. Yo, okay. Yo, just pause it for a sec if you can. It'll be over for if you can. I'll, uh, I'll stop it. Mm-hmm. I'll stop it for now. Or maybe, just, just should I pause it? it? Look at these fucking things. Yo, we're not, this is cool. We're not going to say the specifics of what you say, but I just wanted to tell you... You are the best gore.com watcher. Yeah. You spread it on the show. You spread it to someone else yesterday yeah. in the backyard. Yeah. Why not talk about that, man? It's just an abstract idea. But, okay, can I bring this up? Sure. Okay. In form of protest, is it ever okay to put yourself in harm's way? Like form a chain in front of a fucking tanks and let the tanks run you over or light yourself on fire or shit like I, that. It's never a good idea to kill yourself. But do you think it's good for the world? I don't think it's a good idea to kill yourself, but do you think it's good to... Because it's such a shocking image that it fucking brings sometimes light to that fucking problem the more than it did before. <laughs> but the thing is now, I think everything is so loud in social media, you bring light to it for a day... Yeah. It's fucking gone yeah. in a week. Like, this is the craziest thing. Everyone's saying R.I.P. Ali, right? Mm-hmm. Can you tell me the two other great figures that died recently in the last, like, three months? Of course. Yeah. Who? Okay, Prince died. Kimbo died. Okay. <laughs> Forgot about Kimbo. See, this is yeah. a perfect example. You know who else died, right? David Bowie. David Bowie died. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. But the thing is, like, isn't it funny? Like, people are already forgetting about it. Like, even at us, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is the last couple of months, but, like, at the end of the year... It, it's just, it, I, dude, I don't, I've never listened to David 
Oh, we really? I never listened to Prince, honestly. Me neither, really, oh, brother. No. But I, I never was a fan. Yeah, me neither, really, bro. I mean, I fuck with Prince. But, I mean, I'm not the fucking hugest fan of, uh, of any of those artists, really. Mm-hmm. But, I mean, like, these are people that, like, I know, I recognize. I've seen Prince live, man. It was one of the best fucking the shows. The only reason I know Prince is because of the Chappelle show. Mm-hmm. Honestly. I know Prince a little bit before. And that's probably kind of embarrassing to say, but whatever. Yeah, that's because you're Russian and you're not from Minnesota. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but he, uh, he, yeah, he was in Minnesota. Yeah. Did that press record, man? I hope I did, man. I guess. Let's see here. Yeah. Cause I'm back on road. But yo, um, so you don't think it's right? To what? To hurt yourself in a form of protest. I mean, it could. Do you really think you do it? it? I, uh, I don't know. Oh yeah, my bad. We were yeah. Okay. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> bro, I don't see why you wouldn't want to talk about them. Oh, man. You talk about other shit, man. This show is supposed to be real, man. It's about this shit. I don't know. Maybe that could get somebody in trouble. I, How? I, I have no don't idea. Don't drop any names. Don't say who he is in relation to you. A guy said what? A military vet said what to you? And then just leave it blank. Oh, God. Don't have to say it. You, you, all right, listen. I'm no, not going to make it kind of not to say it, but I'm just like, dude. You can say that story in such a way with just leaving things out. Remember what what one issue is? Mm-hmm. You don't like to lie to people. Me neither, right? Yeah. But it fucks you. Yeah. Because you tell F Dog you're gonna do what? You're gonna record for the show. You tell Alex's girl you're gonna do what? You don't have to tell them shit, but you do it almost every time. Yeah. Are you getting are you getting better about it though, huh? No, I don't tell them every time. I don't tell. Dude, I don't tell anybody anything. Okay, okay. But remember, we're talking about it though. Yeah, cause I was excited about recording the show. I didn't know who to talk to, so Bro. F Dog was the one nearest to me. So I was like, yeah. And then like, wait, are you not excited anymore, man? No, I, I was like, right. super excited. That's why. I, that's why I had to talk to somebody. My man, yeah. You're, and she was the closest person there. Nah, no, I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. Oh, like, oh she had a recording, man. Like. <sighs> The one I put up is when we decided to call her F Dog. <laughs> Just recently, I was like, the F Dog name gets created. <laughs> F Dog name. Gets I was like, created. we just gotta stop talking about her right now. Like, she ends up ended- becoming your wife or some shit somehow. Oh my god. I don't know, it's hilarious. And bro. I'm back on, bro. What are you doing, man? Oh, nothing, I just got another offer for my eBay thing. Oh, wow. Offer? Review offers, yeah. Yeah, cause I'm uh, I'm se- I'm selling something for my mother. Oh, nice. On nice. the internet, and uh, they we're getting a bunch of offers, but nice, now nice. now what we want? Nice. I'm uh, we just sold some shit too, but we gotta get some more shit. Oh, it's funny, man. bro. The sign in front of the shop, it's like a big thing that just said smoke. Yeah, it's a smoke shop. <laughs> just Watch, smoke. bro. In a little bit, I might have a shop like that. Did it? And it's gonna say weed. And you come inside, and it's just. <laughs> Just weed. Yo. I I don't want to stay in Arizona forever, though, I don't think. Nah, not forever. I go nuts here if I stay here forever. I think... I want to have a house here. Yeah, I want to have a spot here, but I can't stay here forever. Whenever this shit clears up, like... Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't know. Like, I, But then I don't know if I want to go to Cali, bro. Cali seems like the spot, but dude, seriously, with the taxes... Seriously, with the roads and the people. And the roads aren't a big deal, but seriously. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Maybe you want to like, move out to Scottsdale or something. Ah, oh, fuck. Why? Like, it's north of Scottsdale. It's quieter, though. Maybe you need a little bit of quiet. Uh, I need... No? I feel what you're saying. I don't know if I want a home base, bro. I have a home I want a home base But I don't know Where I want it And I think I might have Several bases around mm-hmm. And there might be In different states There might be like Okay yeah Out there Fountain Hill Scottsdale mm-hmm. Okay Or or like a- Ocotillo Or South Chandler Or like Queen Creek Right Ocotillo you said Yeah What's that That's nice yo. That Yeah it's nice. a nice area It's where my homies Like fam lives at Um Super nice, but it's like still somewhat like 10 15 minutes away from like Scottsdale and 
Tempe and all that. It's nice and secluded. A lot of Cardinals players live out mm-hmm. there. Um, but, uh, dude, I mean, then having a spot in, like, Montana or Idaho might be tight. Absolutely. Probably, like, you know, like, maybe, like, Oregon, somewhere close to where my homie lives at now. And Have a spot in, like, Colorado, Dude, maybe. definitely, like, if New York was cheaper, maybe Jersey, maybe fucking oh. Buffalo. Just hit that bird, just hit that car. Nah, the bird made it through. Where, I would want to get some place, like, out on the East Coast of the Circle. Maybe Connecticut. You know what I'm saying? Sort of cheaper, but close to New York. Sort of 50 cents. Yo, yo, Boston's nice, too. Fuck Boston. Boston's not a bad city. It sounds like it'd be expensive. Uh, uh, it's nice, dude. Yo, it's very expensive. nice burbs. Uh, so-so. It's yeah. not bad, but yeah, it's definitely, you know, dude, yo, it's Boston. But have a place in Boston over it's in New York. It's nice. Hey, how close is Boston to New York? Four and a half, five-hour drive. God damn. That's deep though. Yeah, the hamster can make it overnight. But Jersey's like an hour. <laughs> Jersey's like 30 minutes, depending where you are, right? Yo, North New Jersey, you're like literally fucking. Ten, you York. can be a 15 minute walk. That's it, you're there. Wow. Really, like literally, you're walking the bridge. I mean, you're there. I'm just trying to think like bases, man. Like, I want them by spot. Like, I love to have a spot in Miami. You go Hoboken. Miami. Yeah, Miami. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're going to spot in Weehawken, Hoboken. Cliffside Park, I mean, dude, anywhere in Bergen County, New Jersey, dude, you're, you're golden. Man. But, I mean, out here is nice, man, but it, it's just like, dude, you know, like, they just get a little crazy here, and I think in Tempe especially, like, I don't know if I want to stick around here and shit. No, definitely not. Like, it's too loud, it's too crazy. Exactly. People are just, like, crazy. A lot of college kids. Yeah, and that comes with, like, fucking crazy policing, and yeah. it starts, like, especially in the summer. Oh, 100%. Uh, you want me to wait here, or should I come in with you? Uh, come in, come in. We might chill for a little bit. I gotta make a phone call. You're disgusting, you're not allowed now. Not in my presence anymore. I'm doing- And we back. We back. Bang. Toy one. I haven't heard that one in a while. It'll never get old. Team Money Malone. Team Money Malone. Oh, it's all about it's all about the war, man. Let's take a look at you, John Irving. A prayer for own me. Dude, I'm gonna, that's that book that you're uh, using. I'm gonna reread. Um, I'm gonna reread uh, the diary of Anne Frank. Oh yeah. Yeah. Isn't that the Jewish Bible? <laughs> no man. <laughs> no. I, yeah, I just want to read it. I don't know why. I just saw it on my shelf yesterday. I'm like, yo, I'm gonna read this one. Nice. Interesting, yeah. crazy story. But yeah, I don't know if it's true. I, I, I hope it's true. I hope it's not some like made up shit. I think it is true, right? I. I I hope so. I hope so too. Um, but, how, but how about that dude that was on like Oprah's book club? Yeah, and he like lied about everything. <laughs> What's that? This guy wrote like wrote like a, he wrote a book, and Oprah picked it to be in her Oprah reading book club or whatever the fuck it's called. And it turned out to be everything he wrote was just lies and lies and lies. So I'm thinking maybe I should just write a book, say it's about my life, and just lie about everything. Get on the fucking Oprah show. Get on her book club. That's it. And then I'll just take the L a little bit later on. <laughs> Whatever, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, take I'll the, just take the goddamn I'll take L the biggest L of the fucking century. What? No, nah, just listen to what you're saying. I'll just take the L a little bit later and keep moving on. Keep moving on, yeah. <laughs> keep it going strong. No, no. They, ain't, they ain't gonna stop me. Ain't gonna stop. Yo, your cross is all water. Uh, that's a lot of water. I get smash it pretty much before it gets buzzed. Buzz oh, oh. yo, can I put away your suitcase for you? No. You sure? Yeah, I'm about to handle it. Didn't you see? I did most of the work. <laughs> yeah, you're about it. to handle that it. That was yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like change. It's all coming together, baby. Bro, life is not easy right now, but it's okay. It's all right, man. Nah, that's good. It's all right, you know. Everything's Gucci. Everything's Gucci, baby. Cause I'm back on road. 
I'm getting money like I'm getting loads. <laughs> oh, sure. Oh, no high speed hot fire. <laughs> Wait, so what's the show called again on Sunday? The other one that we're doing, what's the name of the show? The High Man Loco Project. And what's the fucking gay impression the guy does? What's the guy's name? Hi, man. Hi, man. You know, they might listen to this show. <laughs> you just listen right. to shit. I'm not dissing it. them, dude. <laughs> oh, my goodness, man. Dude, if they probably heard fucking me talk on your show. Bro, yeah, they know we dis- like, They know we kill ourselves. They're probably going to roast us, bro. Oh, please. They're going to be like, oh, hey, see what you did there. What the mm-hmm. thing? What the hi, thing? Man. Fucking piece of shit. Oh, hi, man. And we're like, hi, man. Why'd you have to say that like that, bro? I thought we chill, bro. And he's gonna say, "Fuck you, man. Fuck you, little." You, know, you notice fuck. how our other? You know how our uh, notice how our other guest was Mexican? You notice how you're not Mexican? <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, hold it down for thirty seconds. Mama, I love you. Oh my god. P.O.P. That just came. That was like a knee jerk reaction. I'm like, yeah, hold it down, say something for thirty seconds. Like, Mama, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, I love you. <laughs> P.O.P. Hey. Hold it down. Yeah. How, am I, how am I legal? How am I going to be the driver when I'm legally blind? I remember exactly what you're talking you about. That? Mama, I love you. How am I supposed to drive when I'm legally blind? <laughs> well, uh, sir, can you see now? I'm not a man, I'm a woman. And no, I can't see. Oh, man. Barely. <laughs> this girl was caught in the driver's seat of a getaway car. I didn't do it. Mama, I love you. Oh, man, oh, man. Oh, man. Get in the hole. Oh, baby. Nice. Tell me something. Tell me Tell something, something new, man. Dude. Yo, oh, dude. how long was Chris out here, man? Just chilling, doing his damn thing? Like six years? Like five years. That's nice, man. That's nice. Yeah, now it's back in New York, dude. How's he feel? Like he was telling me, I, I hit him on Snap. He was like, "It's sort of hard to like adjust." Surprisingly, bro, he's gonna come back here, guaranteed. Why? Because I know. Oh, you know he likes it better out here, bro. Guaranteed. He's Why? gonna come back out here. He's gonna get sick of his mom. He's gonna get sick of his fucking sister for, for sure. Wait, why is he out there? Bro, because it's like it's time. He said it's time for him to come back. I thought he he's doing like uh, what you call it? I thought he's doing fucking schooling over there. Yeah. No. Nah. Why go back to New York and do schooling know. there? I don't know, bro. You already did schooling here. Like, why you gotta? Pay? I mean, you think you have to pay out of state tuition? Yeah, he definitely has to pay out of state tuition. Damn. Didn't really like, why not that. pay in state tuition here? But yo, I mean, yeah, if you wanted to be with us, yo, he has friends there, his buddies, like, having a kid, you know, he has, dude, he has a whole separate life there. Yeah, so maybe he's not coming back. And he's, back. you know, bro, he's like a, he's an Italian kid from New York, dude. Always comes back, but I feel like he's going to come back here for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe he's not, though. Dude, he's going to see how expensive it is, because he's, he, he lives at his mom's now, bro. He's going to see how expensive it is to live out there. And it's gonna fucking crush. Uh, dude, and yeah, he's from like a little, uh, he like a little town. Really? Yeah, it's like a little town on Long Island. Like, it's bro, like there's not really much to do, bro. Are you serious? It's like every corner is a deli or some shit. You know, he wants that New York food, the bagels, the pizza. Yo, once he gets sick of that, and he will by the end of the summer, he's gonna come back here. Watch, I'm pl- like I'm planning for this kid to come back here during during like October, November. What? I don't know why. I just feel like he's gonna come back. That early? Yeah. I feel like when I feel like he's someone set in his ways, like once he's like, I'm gonna do this. Bro, he goes. I feel like his mom's gonna piss him off a lot, like when he's there. Is he really gonna live with her? Yeah. Man. He lives at his parents now. That is a little rough, I'm not gonna lie. And plus yo, he was yo, he was banking out here too. You know, doing his hustle. Really? Yeah. Banking, yeah, that's his hustle. No, he uh, he worked two jobs and then, you know, mm-hmm. he was yeah, you know, he he was making good money. Yeah, but I mean that's gonna be all fucking 
different if he comes back. He's gonna yeah, but well, New York is like, dude, I'm telling you, he's gonna get the fuck up out of there. Really? Yeah, dude. <laughs> Bro, you telling me I should go to New York? Yo, everybody's me. moving out of there. Like, the majority of the pop, like, dude, New Jersey and, like, that area of the country, bro, that's areas where, like, the most people are moving out from. Yeah, because it's expensive as fuck, It's right? expensive as fuck, and, dude, I, get, I guarantee you another sandy storm is going to hit that shit. It's going to destroy, like, everything. Oh, okay. Really? Yeah. Guaranteed. Bro, people, were, lie- so, people <laughs> were so not prepared for Sandy Dog. People, like, it was, like, cold. You have to stand in line for gas for, like, two miles, dude. Two mile away with your car. And gas stations had no gas. People had no heat. F- food was going bad. Bro, they were the most unprepared for this shit. Like, as unprepared as you can possibly, like, imagine. All trees fell. Power lines were down. Bro, we didn't have power for, like, ten days. Or, like, seven. No, like, maybe seven days. Damn. Bro. You were Thank there? God we have it. Yeah, thank God we have it. We had a generator. Thank God. And I had to go to, like, so many gas stations, bro, to find gas. I had to, like, go to the gas station in Patterson, New Jersey at, like, 3 in the morning. It's funny, bro. Like, on Twitter, they had, like, a thing. It's, like, a Twitter account of, like, the gas stations that have gas. And, like, they'll post it, right? And, like, bro, like, everybody would be, like, retweeting that shit and, like, going to that gas station. So, you, like, have to be quick on your feet, you know? Damn. So, and I would roll in there with, like, the red gas canisters. I would fucking get, like, mad gallons and just leave. Damn. Dude, it was like a... Bro, drug dealers were accepting gas as a form of payment, dog. Shit was, shit was serious <laughs> out there. Like, yo, three gallons hook y'all with a nice fucking quarter. I'm telling you. Holy yo, shit. Yo, dude, like, that's how bad it was. Like, you don't understand, bro. Like, Coney Island destroyed. Like, do you know Coney Island? Do you know that there was, like, uh, there was, like amusement or, like park rides there? They destroyed. Literally, in the water. Literally. Oh, just like Bicentennial, man. Literally. In the water. You ever watched Bicentennial Man? Long time ago. Oh no, wait, was, was it Bicentennial Robin Man or was it like that one Android movie but that one kid he like goes underwater and it's like Oh not sure. Fucking Coney Island's underwater. Coney Island literally un- uh, underwater. Jersey Shore underwater. Atlantic City was underwater. And Sandy wasn't even like it was a bad storm, but it wasn't like as bad as it could have been. It actually slowed down, they said. Damn. And I mean, all this, dude, all this weather, all of us destroying the environment, bro, that's, if people say that that's not causing some kind of an effect, it's a fucking bold face lie. Definitely. Fucking, I guarantee you, once an earthquake strikes San, San Francisco, all those people are going to move out here, and then our property value here is going to go up like crazy. I mean, one, one earthquake already destroyed San Francisco like a hundred years ago, no? Completely, right? It was like devastation. Yeah. Yeah. You think that can't happen again? I think it's definitely gonna happen. Yeah, I mean, it's coming. It's coming. All that Fukushima radiation going into the fucking beaches of California, I feel like that's definitely gonna happen. Low key, though. <laughs> no! No way! This guy always calls. Yeah. This guy always fucking calls, man. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And now I'm gonna block his number. <laughs> and I'm back on road. Yo, um yeah. Man. I cannot wait. So the goddamn finals is on. Game four. It's hidden. Oh, yeah, dude, that's right. Don't Ten worry. minutes almost, shit. It's okay, I'm trying to get there. Yo, Brown Brown gonna win. You right. think he is? Yeah, dude, it's going, it's going, man, I'm telling you. I'm actually kind of excited to watch the game. It could happen. I don't know. Dude, I wish I could go to the finals, too. That would be sick. I actually saw LeBron play in the playoffs back in the day. Where? It was Cavaliers versus the Nets, like, the second round, maybe, third round, and, oh. I, was at, and I went. And that's I cool. Play. Yeah, dude, me and my bae... Me and my boy Patrick oh, went yeah? to like three games. Yeah, we spent all of our money. We bought like th- all three home. No, all two. Or th- I don't remember. It was either two or three games we went to. But we do. We bought tickets to all the home games. And that's it. Yeah, and we fucking saw LeBron play. He didn't dunk one time. What? We were waiting for it. No breakaway dunk. Not one. Wow. I swear. I don't know what. That was the age of breakaway. I don't know what too. New Jersey Nets like. What kind of D they played on him? But dude, he didn't dunk hard. Not even once. 
and we were super upset. I bet that's the only like. Do you, the main okay, do you remember when day. Vince Carter? It was like it was back when Vince Carter like was on the Nets and like yeah. he had the play and we're like. Like they gave him the ball in the last second to take a last shot, and he like dribbled it off his foot. Do you remember oh, that yeah. back in the day? Yeah, I was there. That was like shit. I was th- there during that game. I was there. Oh man, you it, do it you nice. do remember that, right? I think I do. Yeah, when he like, dude, I was like Nets Cavaliers, and like if the Nets would have won, it would have bring it up to like two two, but instead it went to like three one or something. Damn. And he dribbled it off his leg, and it was Cavaliers ball, and the Cavaliers won. Dude, Vince is nice. And I was dude. wearing a bright yellow LeBron James jersey. I think I told you. Why would you wear LeBron? Because I like LeBron. Dude, LeBron's my man, dude. That's your squad, the Nets, no? No, the Celtics are my squad, and, I, and the Spurs uh, are my squad in the West. Low key, that's low right. Low key. Yeah. Man, you're like very about them, them methodical teams. Yeah, and don't 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 all. think that I'm missing the fact that Popovich's last name is a little Russian. Oh, Gregory. <laughs> do you Popo, know? Do you know how you say Gregory, Gregory in Russian? No. Grisha. Grisha. Yeah, that's his name. Grisha. Really? In Russian. Yeah. Gr- Gregory is Grisha. That's like a, a common Russian name. Is is he? Um, how far away is he from like the motherland in terms of like generations? I don't know. He's bro. I think last generation, dude. He's like second generation American. Oh, nice. Is he an army guy too? Yeah. Really? He's an army guy. I don't know much about him. Yeah. I don't know much about your comrade Gregory. Both of these. Yo, one of the best. Pro- dude, probably the best coach of all time. People have been living under this veil of like super control for a long time mm-hmm. I was just thinking like about the cold war and like what people were not allowed to say or do mm-hmm. like they couldn't make communist jokes mm-hmm. you, you'd be like under a watch list no way dude you couldn't say anything on the phone you couldn't say anything on the phone but let alone imagine you were on the radio or had a show like this and you made fucking communist jokes or Dude, you be uh, fucking bro, they scared. come to your house, pick you up, that's it. Yeah. And then you go to a political rehabilitation center. Yeah. <laughs> you a, a political rehabilitation center in Holy the middle shit. of Shit's Creek. Yeah. And it's going down fast. Dude. There's so much shit fucked up with this world, man. Mm-hmm. And there's the fact so that it hit Hillary up. just clinched the Democratic nomination. Did she? Was that real? I can't even tell if any of the shit that's going on this election. And then really Barack right. was like, "She's she's one the, of one. the most." Oh, she said. Uh, he said that she's one of the most qualified people to ever potentially become president. You ready to go? Yeah. He did say that. I don't know if he's just getting his big homie in the cabinet or what. Probably a little bit of both. I respect what he has to say. Everyone has their opinion. Mm-hmm. I respect why people say that Hillary might even be the best option. Just because he's the most experienced. But you know what? It seems like nobody except maybe Bernie is like really that good of an option. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. even then, it's sort of like a push. Yeah, but dude, yo, it's all it's all the same people in the background, pretty much. Oh, yeah. It's crazy. 100%. These fucking cocksuckers getting their room together. Probably wear their fucking black capes. I thought Bernie said he wasn't going to drop out regardless. He's not dropping out. You can actually still vote for him. Okay. Hmm. But Hillary has all the fucking, all the fucking, uh, delegates, you know, delegates, some of whatever the fuck that means. All right. Well, let's end this. Or no, I guess we usually record while we walk out. Let's do that. Um, dude, how did humans make such a system so fucked up? Like, do we really not give a fuck about each other this much? Uh, people just don't so give crazy. Fuck like. It's and they don't care that the system is corrupt. No, as long as they're getting their peace, as it's fine. Dude, because there's so much other shit that you, you know, that you're and distracted. The system is built so yeah. that even if you care, unless you get your peace, you can't really do shit either. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. you and me, we talk about this. We're aware of this. Besides the show, dude, dude. yeah, I see the hummingbird. No way, that's so sick. You never see them here, dude. No, you don't I pay attention. It's always like a really fun. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. That's so cool. But um. Dude, I don't know, man. This fucking shit is so fucking flawed. But you know what? Do you do you feel like it's getting better? Um, like, there's definitely more people aware of like 
Yeah. Yeah. Because, you know, the, yeah, the be, drug issue. Yeah, it's because of the internet. If we didn't have the, the internet, yeah, we'd be we would so all be living in the, like, concentration camps right now, bro. Probably, dude. Seriously. We'd probably still be living in, like... <laughs> you know, like, yeah. if you think about it, like, the early 90s or the pre-like internet before most people had the internet, yeah. and the 60s, they're not that much different. Yeah. We have almost the same technology. Sort of shitty. But, yo, all right. Hopping out. Anyone who's listening, please improve the world. Love you. Hey, we'll record over phone and then we'll see how long we go. Cause did you have plans tonight? Um, not like set ones. I don't know. I'm still not sure. I might go out with a team or somewhere. I don't know. What are you guys gonna do? I don't know. Maybe gonna move or some something low key. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, we let, then let's not do a full video one, man. Let's just roll around and record, chill. Yeah, yeah, we can. Because an hour and a half. I mean, that'd be like ten o'clock, man. I don't want to push it to that. Yeah, yeah, I feel it. Uh, Bad time? No, no, no it much? doesn't do. It. Are you talking to me? Yeah. I got to get up at six tomorrow, but no, it's not necessarily bedtime. Even though I'll make it But yeah If you go do some shit What I'll probably do Is go there Go there at 6 Cause my homies They've been begging me To go to the lake right mm-hmm. But it always interferes With my schedule But my homie He wants to make it soon But uh Who's gonna go up there So if I meet him Around like 7 We can go And then be back By like noon No one should miss mm-hmm. us You know what I'm saying Yeah uh, I'm supposed to go To my dad's but I'll do that later. My brother, he's in, like, summer, so I could do that even on Monday. Um, you know, this car needs an alternator, for sure. You see, it's, like, slowly getting more and more sluggish to start. So probably by tomorrow or the day after, you might not even start? Um, I think it will still continue to start. It like depends how long it sits, but yeah, I think that after yeah tomorrow, I was planning on driving another like week or so, but I think yeah it might be after tomorrow. I don't want to really want to be stranded. Yo, isn't this where I hop? Just yeah. Yeah. What happened? Yo, it's a nice hotel, no? No, oh. oh, definitely, hundred percent. Cool, man. Shit. And they got a diner in there. What the. F- yeah. Very well. Oh, very Now well. I think I have my mentality straight about... Uh, Yo, tell me about low-key, though. Oh, yeah, that low-key shit. Fucking, um... I walk into low-keys. Esteban's there. <sighs> There's four people there. Yeah. Esteban's there. Of course. Wally's there. Uh-huh. Low-key Lonely's there. Yeah. And then two, his left snuggled up to him is a girl. Uh huh. The girl is. Who? Oh. The chick that we know as Pylophone, aka Paulina. Oh, Paulina's back. Yeah, but remember they broke up. They, 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 they didn't break up. Oh, She's you didn't know the story. Oh, they broke. She left for Europe. Uh huh. She came back. He broke up with her. Uh mm-hmm. huh. Because he didn't want to deal with it anymore, like, a week or two ago. Mm-hmm. And they're back, like, lovey-dovey again. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I guess the story is less funny if you didn't know that. No, yeah, I didn't get know that. But, yeah, yeah. It was just, like, here's this guy who, like, pretty much just says whatever the fuck he wants to say. And then, like, the people around him a lot of times just give it to him, like... Dude, I saw a sn- Remember? I think I told you. I was like, yo, they broke up. There was, like, a snap of her, like... He showed me a snap of, like... Her, like, all happy. Like, uh... Breakups aren't that hard. Or some shit like that. Like... Mm-hmm. Just the dumbest shit. Like, what is wrong with people? Like, you're fu- What the fuck? <laughs> Breakups aren't that hard. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you... Your friends told you that he was hitting them up on Tinder. Not all on Tinder. On Bumble. On Bumble. Okay. Like, and he just broke up with you. Like, mm-hmm. are you seriously going to really think this dude is so awesome? Like, the way they're chilling. Oh, yeah, the cops are chilling. Tell you, this pathological art. Sorry, you let the cops chill. Uh, 
Oh, I think uh, it off. I will, but I don't necessarily. I can't park that easily here. Oh, I mean, this whole mean like. Nah, he's re he's reversing right now, like. Dude. You light the blunt up the here out of nowhere. Huh? Say we light it. We light up the blunt the here out of nowhere. Dude, I had to give up a piece of cheesecake. Oh my god, the cake is in the back of the car. You didn't. I did. What do you mean you had to give up a piece of cheesecake? Did your she asked? No, she didn't. Yes, she did. Get the fuck out of here, BJ! No! You like that? Oh, no! How did she ask? Real cute. Like, how... Oh, it would. Because I it said, I said something that left the door open, and I realized that when I said it, I sort of mumbled it under my breath. It would be like... It was like... Eerily, like, Snoop. Um... When he comes up for the blunt in uh, in half I don't remember. Like I, I like literally ate the last bite, the second to last bite piece of cheesecake, right? And I was like, oh man, I don't even. I was like, I'm so full. I was like, I don't even think I eat this other one. And as soon as I said it, like under my breath, I don't even think I get, I don't even think I got. Uh, you know, and then it just, she's <laughs> pranced over, I was like, oh, fuck. She's like, and she's like, hey, what you got? Sharing's caring. I was like, oh, oh shit. Oh, no. <laughs> I just looked at her, I was like, maybe I'll be hitting that pussy later, but you need to fucking take this one. I was like, you can have this one bite, but that's it. I literally said that. Loki, that's what I said. How stingy. Uh, yo. I was like, nah, you got this, and that's it, homie. And that's it. That, well, yo, I'm interested in Loki and Polina. That's fucking funny. you That's why I was surprised you didn't say nothing about. Oh, because you didn't know. So yeah, they broke up, and then like I told you, Loki had this other chick who I, I think he's fucking, but that chick probably already tossed him. Yeah, definitely. That's why I was like, For yeah, sure. you fucking piece of shit. All you do is ch chill at home, smoke. We're all dude. All he does is chill at home, smoke, and dude. I mean, like. She's such a like I I lost even more respect for her. Like she's such a clown. Like he treated her like shit. Like in the breakup was like just straight up, and she was like crying about it and all she, like, this went shit. Apparently, to Europe. yeah, went to probably Europe. Probably didn't even cheat. On, he he probably was planning on it, so she wouldn't cheat on. Kick wanted to break up with her. Oh, probably didn't. So like she wouldn't cheat on because he knew that if he broke up with her beforehand, that she'd fuck. That she'd fuck some dude. But now, Yo, that's that's fucking rude. And then like, so he can fuck these girls while she's away, and still have Polina like, there. That's fucking rude. But wow, you think he had that plan and yeah, he just wasn't telling anybody? Definitely. Definitely. He's like, All right. What do you mean? That's the move. That's but the then he said, move. but he tried to break up with her, but then failed. Which I guess is the move. That's the move. Yeah. Well, dude, I mean, I tried to break up with her, but her pussy smells like so much, like, just water that I just wanted. <laughs> Wait, what? Remember, that's what he always used to say. Like, he used to say something he used about to, He used to always say that her pussy smelled good. Really? Like, didn't smell like anything, and that's what he liked. Oh, my God. And I'll, and, but then he always talks about how her legs are gross. It's like, dude. You're just Who airing the shit that girl like that, dude? That's what I'm saying. I was like, you're airing hey, the shit out of man? man? I should know about all that. What kind of a man talks about his current girlfriend and like those? Maybe friends, with your home. Yeah, I don't know. Like, are even we with your homies and homies. Podcast tomorrow or what? We're doing. Oh, we're killing that. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Man, man, man. Dude. Yeah, we're gonna rock that shit. We're rocking all of them, bro. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We rock. That's my them. shit. All girls I'm gonna run that drunk. <laughs> Ain't no holla back girl. Yo, what the fuck is the name of the Huff is gay alter persona? Who? The, the fucking guy on the show we're gonna I don't know tomorrow. if he named his I don't know <laughs> if he gave his persona a different name. But it's Jaime. Jaime <laughs> That's his name. Oh Jaime. Who <laughs> Ooh, you got such a big cock, Jaime. Ooh. Oh yeah. Yeah, <laughs> he was like tweeting the show account. I was like, "Yeah, this this one's killing him." That's funny. I ain't even fuck. I ain't even um joking. Like, like he could be cool, dude. They all, yeah. they probably, they're probably both pretty dope. I, dude, I'd be down to meet him. Why not? A what? little bit of Texas. I said I'd be down to meet him. Why not? 
I haven't really met somebody from Texas in a while. I mean, we're gonna meet him over the phone. Texas, in Texas. If you talk to someone, does that mean that you met him yeah. over the phone? Uh, yeah, I met the guy. We spoke yeah, over the phone. So if I spoke to Cam over the phone, I met him. I don't think so. If you're on a name to name basis, yeah. If he knows your name, then yeah, you met him. Oh, I got you. I got you. Cam. So I'm on a name to name basis with Buster Rhymes. Well, yeah, I mean, uh, back in the day, um, my piano teacher, right before 9-11, like, we were supposed to play for the Grammys, right? Mm -hmm. Like, me and my sister, part of this group performance for my, uh, for my piano teacher, because she was coming out with some book or whatever, but, Mm -hmm. (sighs) Excuse me, nine eleven happened, so they just completely trashed that idea. Mm-hmm. But um, my piano teacher met Busta Rhymes, and like we were supposed to do some sort of collaboration with him for this show for the Grammys. And then he was like, "Oh, who um, who, am, who am I performing with? Who are these two kids?" And he's going to perform with me and my sister. And so my name, my government is Vijay, right? Mm-hmm. My Indian name, my real name, and my sister's is Jainty. So this fool like made a rap, the Jainty, the Jainty, some shit like that. Cause like my my brother or my my dad, he set it up for our names like all like go into one. Like he could write mm-hmm. our names all together. Yeah. All the siblings, all his son- mm-hmm. children. Well, yeah. That fool rap my name, but no, I didn't even talk to him on the phone. But he knows my name. So you said, I mean... You should tweet him? You should tweet him. Like, yo, bro, he ain't gonna remember that. He probably smoking high as shit. My, my uh, piano teacher was like, yeah, he smoked coming in like a pound of cheaper. <laughs> boss of boss. But, but we should tweet him. You fuck with, tw- you fuck with Buzz? Not really. No? I never liked the fast rapping shit, unless it's Twista. I never thought Busta was good at, uh... Really? Rapping fast. I, I, ne- I never nice. liked I never liked him. I never liked his voice. I love Busta was nice. Dude, what is all this, man? You have all this weed on your forearm, bro. I just spilled it all out. Stuck in your hair? Oh, what? Not Did, all. You dropped a lot? No, 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 no. Like that. I'm like, one more thing. Man, this guy. You're, you know you're a legend in the making, right? <laughs> <laughs> the legend of Team Manny Malone. This uh, one of my friends was like, "I'm going to the comedy club uh, later today by the Papago uh, Park," and I was just thinking about how awesome it would be if we were somehow in that show. Oh my god! Dude. And then we were just like came out. <laughs> that would be fucking insane. And then you kept talking about your five hundred dollars shirt that you never ironed. <laughs> Listen, guys, listen, guys. I haven't worn that shirt in like a while. I have a lot of class. I just don't take care of my shit. Yeah. Listen, I got a couple $500. Like, my car got repoed, right? Yeah. And I see it out the window, and I see my car going up, and I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. And come on, I'm like, man, can I, can I get my shit, man? Can I get the shit out of the car at least before you take it? And he's like, fine, man, fine. And this is expecting me to go in the glove or something. Like, nah. I got, I got all these clones. I, got I need my things. shirt, dog. I'll pop the trunk. I grab my five hundred dollar one emergency I shirt. Swear. I swear. I grab these <laughs> house slippers that are torn to shreds. Yo. But are held by one piece of plastic. This is your comedy bit right now. I'm writing it for you. I'm writing it for you. Because you should come out. You should be like, yeah, yeah. My name's Tolly. My comedy's written by VJ. He's performing right now. Dude, right I will. Dude. <laughs> I'll fucking kill it in stand up comedy for sure. I have a feeling. So then I go to my house, right? And then I'm like, shit, I've never decided to buy hangers in my life. So there's this little corner in the right, right? I don't, I don't really jack off in the corner. That's mm-hmm. the other corner. But in this corner, I just throw the uh, $500 shirts there. I don't throw them in a the ball. I throw them, I sort of lay them out. If I just throw them on top of each other. Boom, boom, boom. boom. <laughs> You don't have to say. Yeah. <laughs> you, you don't have to protect yourself because yeah, I know you don't do it, but the fucking crowd doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> it's all about making you seem like a true scumbag. 
What do you think I've been? I've done some things in my life, man. Dude, I've, I've done some things in my life. Like, like, yo, yo, you see the guy who came before me? Like, we know each other. He has a story about five hundred dollars shirts. I have five hundred shirts. They don't even cost five hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you like that? You like that? that? <laughs> what were you pointing about this for, dude? Was See, I rationed down a little bit of blood for the bowl head. It's my move. Just because you can't roll Yo, up. that's you, my you, move, though. What about the bowl that's on the ground, homie? What about the bowl that's on the ground, homie? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> But totally be dropping No, he's saying like Nah, I got this I'm gonna roll this up He said, I got this Nah, VJ, you chill You don't even know how to roll Yo, 28 homie. minutes later 27 minutes later Bro, I just not Yo, you're gonna like One of my <laughs> buddies On the show, dude For sure When he what goes from Jersey on? I don't know, dude He's uh, he's in Jersey right now He's like was He's he going the, to school there He's my the Asian teacher? buddy was no, he the teacher? no, no, no The teacher's staying in Jersey For a little while Okay Sick scumbag. Sickest scumbag. He made an appearance on the show. He we talked sick. about him for the first time on the Scum show I just tanning. posted. Do you have a light Scum Tan. <laughs> oh my god, I just remember his name. Scum Tan, yeah. <laughs> you don't even know. He's a sick hunt. Enough to make the hair on your ass fall. There you go, man. Hey, by the way, Russia had a draw with England today in soccer for the Euro 2016. I see. Yo, Euro Is 2016 the started. No. The deal, the Euro Cup? Oh, it just started. Yeah, it just started. Let me get a light, of course. Or an uh, Astro for us. How do you think it's best for me to handle the low key situation? No. Uh, should I text him something like. I just left my house. Your bikes are in front of my lawn. But if a bum takes them, it's fine. But you don't find them. Speak up. How do you think I should do it? Speak up. I uh, was asking how I should uh, give back Loki Z his bikes. I already figured that you'd talk to him in some form or fashion. Dude, I just told him that they would be in front of my house today, but I just to fuck with them, I canceled on purpose. Sorry. Forgot. Nice. So yeah, you should tell him that you're not home. And then if he looks inside and sees you, you don't respond. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And then your homie Chris Catania could come and just smash him in the face. He's a scumbag. Dude, I feel like you rolled that a little too tight, huh? You try to make it look all sexy. You must have had your cornrows rolled too tight. And that's it. Oh my god. <coughs> Talk about the fake of fake. It looks like you're passing it, now you're trying to like <coughs> dry to it. Dry it. <laughs> Fuck. What's up, dude? Wow, that was a big hit, dude. No, so how do you think I should do this, dude? Should I, should I just throw his bikes on like two corners of my lawn, one on that side, one on that side? <laughs> yeah, why not? What do you know about? What do you seriously think? What do you think I should do? If I had time, I would be. I would attach the bikes together and take one of the wheels off. <laughs> And make it a three-wheel bike. Just one three-wheel bike. <laughs> be like, make some mods for it, bro. On the Shallow the air out of a star before I give it to him. Maybe you should stab the tire. So that, it, <laughs> so that it's slow, you know what I'm saying? But that when he fills it up, it just, like, lets out a little bit. You should, like, stab it with, like... <laughs> Something thin. Oh, I need you. I like. You <laughs> like I like you, dude. <laughs> you like that? So he'll be like filling up a couple times. Like, what's going on? <laughs> what's going on? What's going on, man? Hmm. I mean, I don't know how sick you want to go, but I'd say sterilize the handlebars and then rub your dick all over. 
to pee all over the bike. Oh, yeah. Pee all over the handlebars. That's, That's actually so, so low. Low. Oh my God. That is super Am I low. Stupid? Yeah, dude, I'm stupid to that level, dude. That's not good. All right, you want to know what a homie would really do? Yeah, what, what would, would a homie do? Yeah, yeah, what would you do? I would throw him on the half sidewalk, half street. I <laughs> like not even on the lawn, like on the city property. <laughs> and I might wait. Should I like have him warm up one in the minute? sun? Yeah, should I just put him up and have him warm up in the sun for the longest time so he can like he barely can even pick him up? They're so hot. No. I think what you should do is like go send him up how you would in the front of your lawn slash sidewalk, and then kick him onto the ground sideways. Should I cut his brakes? Trying to go in, got no brakes, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's that, so dirty. That can kill that him. That can be bad. That can be bad. That that we should not do. But peeing on the handlebars, letting that shit lay on the sidewalk on the ground, so he knows how you feel, and hopefully having it heat up nice, so when he grabs it. <laughs> Yo, funny you didn't mention my tightly rolled blunt for some reason. Yeah, it wasn't that tightly rolled. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Probably because you couldn't fit all the weed in there. No, dude, it was my thing. It's the bowl hit after the... It's the fucking icing on the cake, dude. Seriously. What movie are you going to watch with F-Dog, you sick fuck? I don't know. I might, I might even hit a pubfilm.com and just, like, like uh, watch like, a pirated movie or something. So what should I do with V, man? You think I should fuck her? Right in the pussy. Right in the pussy. Yeah. But where? I'd have to take her somewhere. Like where? Her room that's four feet to the fucking right? She has a room? I thought that's She, her. like, lives with her sister, pretty much. She's been here for, like, a month. Yeah, what, I'm supposed to smash month. her with her sister just watching? Her sister, yo, her, her sister will, yo, will let you guys chill. She gets down. I mean, the sister gets down. I mean, why not the older sister? Why am I going to fuck on top of all that juice? Yeah. Fuck. Come on. I, I wasn't even that. against it. I'm not even against <laughs> I'm it. I'm not even against it. Is that a five hundred dollar shirt? No. You said five fifty. No, that's the other one. It's, it's my and that a man and give those then, yeah. F dog changed to just go to the restaurant or to the the grocery store for five seconds. Well, yeah, she was in pajamas. You don't leave in your pajamas. The, the pajamas are for the house only, you know. I mean, I wear. Pretty much my briefs when I go to sleep, yeah. my boxer briefs, so I wear them all the time. Yeah, I get my car back on Monday, Monday, Monday. Congrats, Monday. homie, congrats. You pumped? Yeah. Yeah, how pumped are you? The so same car? I'm actually gonna watch, yeah, same car for like three more months and then see. That's it. Day. Nice, dude. We'll be back to normal. Mm-hmm. And then hopefully my shit is all good and then everything is perfect. Mm-hmm. Saudi Arabia. Yo, you can like... I don't want to talk about my you shit. You can like... Uh, I was like looking up online. I just want to correct this. I, was, I, I just was like was looking through the job section. Right? Just, I, I was just curious like what the fuck was in there. And bro, you can make money... Delivering shit for Amazon? Mm-hmm. 15 hours? Or like 14 bucks an hour? 15 bucks an hour or something? Yeah. I didn't know that. What the fuck? I mean, I can't... I can't do Uber. Right. I can't do Lyft. I didn't even know. Like, I didn't even know Amazon... Delivering for Amazon? Yeah, what? you can deliver... You can also do the food delivery thing, too, I think. No, I'm not gonna deliver, but... It's just interesting that you can, like, all these new shits are popping up. But you can probably, like, yeah, I can't do none of the driving shit. But my I can't car's do too old. Shit. Ah, my car's too old. I have too many infractions within the last seven years. I need a clear driving record to be able to do that, sir. By yo, that time, yo, I'll yo, be a millionaire. You want to put that ad up for, like, uh, one or two more rounds? Why? Where are we going to go? Nowhere. Just, are we going to do the video? Nah. Oh, okay. Because it's going to take longer. Okay. Oh, okay. 
No, because I thought you came back here. Yeah, like I said, came back here. You around. I was like, okay, so we come back here. I thought we would do the video, but it's all good. Well, what I'm thinking is... We can periscope it. Oh, you want to shout a shallow periscope? That can be like... Tomorrow, when we when we do the, the phone, I was thinking that we should periscope. I'll tweet it to my page. You'll retweet my tweet, and then you'll tell them, hey, can you guys just retweet? I guess that tweet took a three-way retweet. Three way retweet. Three we tweet. Three we three tweet. Yeah, I, I need to set up a periscope for the show so that we can do it during the show. And yeah, shit. but you claim. <laughs> Go down periscope. But you but claim. claim. Oh. Actually, this one does a lot of work. You think about it's, it. Yeah, it's a machine. You need a bigger one though. You need like the shit that I have for sure. Dude, you can edit all. Li- Yo, literally, you can edit all your shit. Up. I know You can record Edit You can put music You can edit the music Right fucking on uh, Right on there Probably I probably even could on here But I'll just wait till the next one Comes out on the press On the strokes mm-hmm. I'm not too crazy If I need it I'll get it But Yeah I feel like you're like An iPad guy too Really? Yeah I've never had one why would I be an iPad guy? I don't know. It's like a super organized. Sort of. This place is a fucking mess. Yo, can I get rid of that luggage bag for you? Please? Dude. You no. know how many shows in a row I think I've mentioned that bag? So many. No, seriously, dude. So many. <laughs> can I get rid of it? You know how many, you know how many things have happened in the show? When I re-listen to him, I'm like, oh my god, it's like... Yo, when I found out about Low-Key, though, that was live. That was sweet. That was live. Da, da. A lot of shit happens live on the show, dude. This show is sweet, man. It might be, it might be the best show that we've ever done. <laughs> really? No, dude, I, mean, I think every show we do is pretty good, no? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just meant Honestly, the I show, think, yo, we can't get show. smoked out too much before the videos. No, no, we can't get smoked out too much before any of them. That. Especially you, I think you get super random. You just bust out of nowhere and you just don't give a fuck what anyone's saying. Yeah. Like, you'd be like, you'd be like, and then so totally, the reason that you brought up dinosaurs, you know, they're not dolphins. And you're like, and the reason that they're not dolphins, to go exactly to what you asked, you're like, so how about them dinosaurs, boy? <laughs> how about <laughs> them dinosaurs, boy? It's like, well, the. The, wait, what was I talking about? And then my smoked out ass is like, I don't know. <laughs> where are we? Where, where are, are we? we? <laughs> wait, where are we, dog? <laughs> what? What just happened? And then we do, <laughs> we we indulge whatever you're saying, and then we're like, wait, what was happening? What's about the drink? Yo, that looks like there's like stuff in there, right? It looks disgusting. <coughs> <coughs> ah, Jesus Christ, dude. Great show, honestly. The Psycho P Show. Yo, what else would you name the show if you had to rename it? Like, if you were to rename it. I already what? know. What? I already know what I'm going to name the next show that I but do. But you can't say it? No, I'll name it. Uh, it's Mr. Name VJ. Mr. VJ? No, it's Mr. VJ. It's just just like my handles. It's Mr. VJ. But yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, that'd be like maybe a solo one real quick of just me yelling at people. And then yeah. we'll just do another one like this. But then maybe name it something else. But for this, we're just going to ride it with this. Get some sort of notoriety and be like, all right, we're sick of the show name. Let's do it right. And then use everything I learned and shit, everything that we've gone through, and then just do it up. It'll be pretty much the same show. Yeah. But it'll probably be called... Tickle Dicklebert. <laughs> stop, stop. <laughs> that would be something that's, like, easy to get. No, hold on. The Potter and Family, dude. I saw that on your thing. Yeah, but that's that's just a hashtag that everyone uses now on the podcast and shit. Really? Yeah, I oh, know. No, what I would say would be, um, I thought about it. Um, the first show that I made, the one that ended at two episodes, was, uh, How Wrong Are We? Or something like that. Everything is bullshit? You know, but we can't have a curse word in the title. Some of the distributors don't allow you to do that. Or you have to, like, bleep it. 
What are the adult video awards? <laughs> what? The AVAs. What are the AVAs? The AVNs? The AVNs or whatever it's called. The adult video awards? Yeah, what is it the AVNs? No, why is it called AVNs though? Adult video... What the hell is the N? I know it's called AVN, but I don't know what the hell the N is. Nomination. That doesn't make sense. Yeah. I, th- I, th- I thought it was the AVAs. The mm-hmm. adult video awards. Get a bunch of slutty chicks in one room. Jesus Christ. Right. I know you're trying to go. Yeah? Well, what's F Dog gonna say? I don't care. You and F Dog, you're serious now. Nah, not really. Not like serious, serious. But in public, you open the door for her. In Dude, private. That, that's just a joke. That, that's like a ongoing joke. <laughs> I don't think I she thinks that's a joke. Oh, no, dude, trust me. She definitely thinks it's a joke. No, 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 dude, trust no, me. No, dude, yo, the joke goes deep. Okay, explain the joke. The joke is yeah, no, the yeah, best the Saudi. Co- All right, so the best Saudi couple would would be to make it seem like the guy is super strict with the girl in front of that, like everybody. Right. But in reality, when like every, everybody leaves, he's just like a complete bitch, and the wife just like runs shit and they do it just for show. You know, like. What? Yeah, That's so, it. and, like, I'll do, like, random shit, like, throughout the day, like, and go back to that joke, you know? Uh, it, it's weird, like, like, have her serve me food in front of everybody, but in reality, <laughs> like, I just make all the food and I put her in the fridge and she just microwaves it, like, when it's time, you know? And she'll serve <laughs> it to me, like, with her hands on, like, here, bastard. <laughs> you know? Hey, wait, is this just happened, like, does she, do you, do you guys plan to do this, like, normally she would cook, but because you plan to do this, you cook? Or would you already normally cook and this is just part of the joke? No, 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 no. The only reason I cooked that night was just good. Not because of the joke, because I just wanted to go. Yeah. I didn't even cook that much. I just cooked the rice, dude. She brought over the fucking chicken. Chicken. Because her host family made it. The fly family. The fly family. <laughs> apparently okay, Lord of the Fly So she <laughs> Apparently her fucking uh, Lord of the fly Her whole family <laughs> You like yeah, that? Yeah right the Lord of the Fly <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead Go ahead Go ahead apparently, apparently it's a problem Around their neighborhood Like, so, like something happened It's like bad flies Yeah it's probably because uh, It's like next to like a milk factory Or some shit You know that dairy Oh uh, yeah What is that? What do you mean? It's like a dairy fucking farm. There's a dairy in processing there? plant. No, they get dairy in there and they like process it and shit. I think it smells all weird. It smells all sorts of danky. Oh, fuck. There's a Nabisco factory in North New Jersey, and dude, every time you drive past it, you like open up your windows. Like I literally do this every day, like during the summer and like nice weather. You like drive past it, you open up all the windows. It smells like popcorn and cookies and like dude it smells so fucking good like Nibisco. butter just like butter like you open up the windows and your whole car gets like engulfed in this like this buttery smell dude yeah. it's fucking amazing on the way to Glen Rock, New Jersey yeah buddy your type of spot kid Glen Rock, super nice dude I gotta take that cake out the car that's what I'm thinking what are you doing, dude? Go take the cake out of the car. I'll take care of that. No. No. What you're holding? I'll get the cake out a little bit. Yeah. You were really looking forward to that last bite of the cake, huh? No, that's all good. No, no, no. I just Sh- hope I just hope I get that pussy. Sharing is caring. Sherry's berries. But then she tells me she's a lesbian. She's bi. Yeah, she's a lesbian. There's bi. no way a girl can get can't give up the fucking warm D. Can't replicate it, dude. I know. Can't, can't do it. Won't do it. But they can replicate the pussy, sir, dude. Apparently. I mean... Like, yeah, apparently those you get robots war- where you fuck up You get warming fucking lube? Yeah, then maybe. Because then your dick's on fire and you can't even tell if you're fucking a lump of wood or a woman. A Probably. lump of water. <laughs> what the fuck is a lump of water? A lump Snow- of wood. Oh, uh, a lump of wood, nice. I was going to say a lump of water. So There's no way I said water. Maybe. Yeah, no, but a lump of wood. No, you probably said wood, and I said water. Seriously, dude. Oh, dude, if you take Viagra, oh my god. What? what? Dude, if you take Viagra, you, you can... You know, just the fuck, dude. You can fuck fucking anything. 
can fuck as ugly as the woman is, it doesn't even matter if your dick won't stand up, you just pop that Viagra. Hard in like five minutes. Bro. I don't want to pop a Viagra though. In Russia, they're over the counter. How funny is that? Oh, what? You can go to the store and get Viagra. Uh, even as a kid? Yeah. I mean, the pharmacist most likely won't sell it to you, but you can go and try. I think. I never tried to buy it as a kid. That's so weird, dude. That's so weird, dude. Yeah. Yeah, you better take that cake out, dude. Yo, yeah. Kobe? Yeah, do it. Nah, my... Is that shit closed? Yeah. Try it, try it. See if you can make the shot. Damn, son. Yeah, more like Rick Fox. Go get him, Luke Walton. Fuck. There he is. Alvadenko. <laughs> Karolenko. What the... Easy, too. No, Karolenko is nice. Yo, Karolenko is super nice. Remember his wife? No. He's like that Russian uh, Britney Spears. Damn, she was fine. The Russian Britney Spears. Yeah, that's Karen Lincoln's wife. Yeah. Who is the Russian Britney Spears? You would know. I'm not, I'm not even sure. Mm, she's probably bad, though. Of course. No, I don't know about Russians. She's probably Bro, this guy, Britney uh, Spears. Like, he's shit. like in charge of the basketball in Russia or something. Like He has like a super high post. Oh, he's nice. He's, he's a good yeah, basketball Russian player. Basketball. Yeah, dude, he has really good fundamentals. Like he was, like he, yeah, like he wasn't ever like the star star, but he was the a defensive star. Player. Yeah. Oh, dude, he was uh, NBA uh, like first, like all first team defense. Yeah, I think he was defensive player one year. AK forty seven. Yeah, like nice thing. I wonder if he did that on purpose. Of course. Yeah. Come on, of course. 47. Andrew Hakielenko. Did you see that uh, Vitaly ran up on the court yesterday? During, oh, the, yeah. during the Cavaliers Golden State game? Who? Why is that dude famous? He, Internet, right? Yeah, dude. He does a lot of pranks on YouTube and he ran on the field during the World Cup, actually. Which was insane. <laughs> and they, like, all his boys taped it and, like, he was like tweeting shit. He was like, "Guys, like, I'm gonna do something crazy, something big. Just watch the game." But like, tweeted that, and like everybody was watching him. Did he go do naked? No, actually, I don't, I, I'm not sure. I don't think so. I feel like you have to do those things naked on the soccer field, right? I don't know. Is it really worth it with your clothes on? Just like you just get grass shit. all up on your dick. I don't know. Well, you know your ass is getting tackled. Oh. You're getting fucked up. Yeah, that's fun. I've seen some do some pretty good... Oh, yeah, of course. Yo, because it's game on for the fucking security guards. They know that, oh, shit, there's a guy just right on the field. They can technically fuck the guy up, dude. Yeah. Heavily. (laughs) They can, like... And they want to. Shoulder tackle them, boom, break their whole fucking shit. Yeah. They don't mind if they run into each other. Yo, since when is Michael Strahan on Good Morning America? I thought you were doing the thing. Dude, I saw the thing... Today, I'm like, what the fuck? This guy's like a... He's an actual host now. Dude, he was a... Dude, he was a part of that... Kelly Ripa and Michael Yeah, but like, that's good, good Morning one. America is even bigger. That's no, like, I know. That's but crazy. Saying, he just got yeah. that other role, that's too. That's crazy. He just sounds so shit. That's awesome. He never wanted to fix his teeth, too. I like that. Just kept that shit, like... He gapped as fuck. Dude, I almost want to take you... To the spot and let you chill in the car for a little bit. Would you hit the Would you hit the gas pedal for sure. run in for a little bit just to keep the alternator charging? Yeah. Then I can roll to your crib and chill there until you leave. Okay. And just hang out. I mean, I'm not 100 percent sure that we're going yet, but. Well, then yeah. I could chill for a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Dude, yeah, let's go. Can we record? What do you mean? On the way there. Yeah. Nice. Yo, keep it rolling. You know, let's go. Yeah, of course. Can I come in and see the madness for like a second? Do you want yeah, to? please. I'm so curious. Right, I well, want to get this on tape. No, we can't record it, though. No, can I? At my phone? I want to see the fucking... The, 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 I want to see the jungle. Okay, okay. We can't. Okay, okay, okay. okay. All right. Okay. Uh, Last the man. Yeah. Coach, keep it rolling. Don't even stop him. No, I know. All right. Should we just leave it or... Yeah. Leave it? Yeah, I don't even... We can Dude, show. leave it. All good. Fuck. 
You can subtract another dollar fifty. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm pretty sure that has something to do with me there. Yo, that look. Yo, that look. <laughs> that crazy look? The Kevin Hart look? The Kevin Hart look. That's you, dog. That is. I found it, dude. I was laughing so hard. <laughs> oh, my God. You saw it and you're like, oh, my God. This is BJ. Dude, look. that's fucking BJ. All right, let's go. That really is my look, dude. It's so bad. Yeah. Like, when he said it, I just looked over like, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. That's it? I've seen it. I've seen it. I've seen it a couple times. A couple times, Thompson. Look, oh man, I forgot it's still recording. Look, if for this for this environment, I even switch in my shoes. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So, do you not hold any um, ill will or any grudge towards F Dog for that whole wheelchair thing? The yeah. wheelchair boyfriend? No, but that was a funny thing. Huh? Was, no, but that was a funny situation. Yeah, it was a fucked up situation. Mm. Then, of course, I'm the, <coughs> I'm the better guy, obviously. I'm, obviously. I'm just, yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's no way she found a better dude. Wait, oh, you're the best guy in the world? You're pretty confident, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you just laughed. <laughs> you're like, oh. I'm not too bad. Uh, I mean, it didn't happen. Then what happened? The wheelchair thing, it was funny though. Yeah, it's a funny thing to like. Uh oh. What? The clicker didn't work. Stop. I promise you, but sometimes it's just because it's close. Oh man. Come on. See. Come on, car. You can start, buddy. This is getting shaky. Yo. It's getting sketch. It's getting sketch Cars. as fuck. Dude, if we, uh... Yo, when, um, when I pull up, you're gonna have to jump in the driver's seat and hit the gas. Okay. Oh, no, you're coming in. Yo, I kinda wanna come in. Hold on. Or is that, or is that not a good idea? Only you I'd bring to this fucking place, dude. I don't wanna talk I'm about it. To see it. You're pulling some crazy moves in the parking lot. You went... <laughs> through three parking lots of three different like little <laughs> complexes. Yeah, because any uh, yo, because you can't go hold left. On, hold on, there, right? hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, all right, you get it. <laughs> this yeah. this episode might be so fucked up later. Oh god. <laughs> oh, oh, this might god. be the first time we had it. No, 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 no. Oh yo, look. There's at this there's been yeah, other times where we admitted, though. and it will be. If anything, some parts might just be. Smell down. Oh, smell down. Alright. Alright, I guess it does. Wow, wow, wow.